lucky enough to live in a country or in an area where the uh, air is always pure, there's no pollen, you never have any allergies, but there's a lot of us who live in areas where that is a big problem. There's a lot of countries that are having trouble with air quality. And a company called Wind, W-Y-N-D, is uh, aiming to try to help you create a bubble of pure air just for yourself. And I'm here with Raymond Wu from Wind, and he's going to tell us about that. Thanks. So I'm Ray, and the Wind product is actually two parts. We want to clean your air, so there's a purifier. You can turn it on, and basically by uh, spinning the top, you can you can control the level of um, airflow. Um, the more I'm going to explain a little yeah. bit for the audio listeners yeah. too. So he's got a cylinder that's maybe what uh, I don't know, eight ten inches long, a couple inches in diameter, and he's turning the top of it. It's got a nice blue light, and he's uh, there's a fan blowing air out of it. Yep, and inside's a medical grade filter that filters out anything from allergens to pollen to pet dander all the way down to the size of very tiny particles um, such as car exhaust, industrial pollution, and even bacteria. Uh, and on top of the purifier side of things, we wanted to give people insights about the air quality because air is mostly invisible. So how do you know when it's bad or even getting better? And so we basically invented our own air quality monitor. So he just pulled a small chunky piece out like the size of a car fob out of the bottom and that, that piece is called the air quality tracker and we invented it because we saw that um, air quality monitors out there are really big and expensive and they shouldn't have to be. We wanted people to get insights about the air quality without having to spend a lot and having something that's so small they can carry it around with them if they wanted to. So this is the size of my thumb and if you wanted to you can bring it with you. It has a week long battery life and it'll give you insights about the air quality, what you're breathing um, and then when you need to you can take out the purifier. It's almost like a big brother and they work together to basically monitor and then clean the air automatically. Uh, so, so if I'm, I'm wondering how is my office, I don't know whether, you know, I've been sneezing a lot or my nose is dripping, what is it, what's going on, is there something in my office, you could carry that around, monitor it over time, and how do you get the data off of this, where does that come in? So we use Bluetooth low energy, uh, it's very safe and it basically connects to your phone and the phone aggregates all that and interprets it for you and we have a good um, uh, set of designs to basically make that very transparent. So it'll tell you, for example, today we filtered out this much pollution. It's equivalent to you not breathing in this many cigarettes. Oh, I example. love it. I love it. So for you example. put it in a metric we can understand. Yeah. And then on top of that, we know wind is designed initially for kind of a personal experience. It's for your own air quality. It's for your own sensing and purification. But on top of that, when we have all these sensors deployed, uh, we want to create a ways of air quality. And so today at CES is the first time we're debuting this. It's actually the first crowdsourced air quality, uh, I think, ever with mobile sensors. And um, what I'm showing you here is he's basically... Got a, he's got a display map of uh, Las Vegas and there's a bunch of uh, little dots and a lot of them are blue with little numbers on them, like 17, 19, 21. We see some bad ones, though. Tell us about this. Yeah, so we had users, uh, basically our customers walk around with these sensors and they went into casinos, they were outside, they were at the airport, and and um, we were, they were collecting data for themselves, but also for the whole community. And here we're showing you all of the data that was collected just in one day. And you can see some places are very uh, clean. Um, the, the, the circles are very blue. There's a number in there called the air quality index. It's a very, it'll be a very low number if it's clean. But there's, then there's some other numbers that are purple or yellow or orange, meaning that those areas were not very clean. I do not want to go to that 450. That yeah. is not a good place to go. That looks like it was very bad. Maybe there were people smoking, was a smoking lounge or something. But when we get this density of data, we hope we can give a lot more insights to people about how to keep themselves healthy. So there's a crowdsource piece to that, and you, as, as a member of the wind community, you get access to this data? Yeah, actually that data is free for everyone. Um, we we have an app called Air Bubbles. It's for iOS and Android called Air Bubbles. And it shows air quality from all around the world. But uh, when we get our devices deployed, the actual hardware, we're going to add to that and it's going to create much more insights than what we have already. So you've got metrics, real honest to God metrics, you can really see what you're doing and understand and a device that's beautiful that I mean it would look gorgeous on a desk. It's uh, one of it's white, I see you have a black one as well. It's got the pretty blue light. Everybody loves a blue light on top, you know that. You can change the volume of the air being blown at you in the in the uh, uh, purified form. It's got a little kickstand. This is a beautiful product. It looks
looks like it solves an interesting problem, and I, I, I love metrics. I'm a crazy person for metrics. Uh, when do you expect the uh, win to be available? It'll be available in April, uh, and it's available already right now for pre-order on our website at hellowind.com. So H-E-L-L-O-W-Y-N-D.com, and how much are we talking? 154 for the pre-order, and it'll go up to 189 for the uh, retail price. That is not bad at all. That's, that's pretty impressive. Well, this is fantastic. Thank you very much, Ray. Appreciate your time. Thank you, Allison. Thank you.